Search for App Mink. All right, today we're getting some help from Mr. Pig. Oh, stop! We've got to bring the passenger section over. Line those wheels up. Oops, missed. Oh, here's the cab. That's why they missed. That looks great. Let's get some photos. Don't forget the mirrors. And lastly, the seats. With our friendly bus driver, Mink. Mr. Pig is our first passenger. Let's go for a drive. Oh, forgot something. The engine. That sounds better. Wow. Looking good, Mrs. School Bus. See you again soon. Welcome back to At Mink Town, everyone. There's a vehicle meet today for the awesome vehicle competition. And some of the vehicles from At Mink are here to show off what they can do. Monster Truck is raring to go. Digger is pushing his way into position. What an impressive jump! The school bus is flying on over. The crane truck's here too, and ready to roll. Are we missing someone? Ah, it's the garbage truck, cleaning up before he gets in position. The monster truck jumps out first to show us what he can do. Howdy kids, I'm the monster truck. I'm the coolest ride in town. I love getting paint jobs and doing stunts. Check out my huge tires. I also have a strong chassis and extra suspension for jumps and tricks. And my engine is extra powerful. I like showing off tricks to my friends, but it often gets me dirty, and I hate taking them back. 
but I think being dirty just ain't cool. Girl, out of my way. Hey, wait. Kids, if you want to be cool, you've got to be strong. Look at my strong arm. I can dig holes and move heavy things. And look at my strong blade. I can move even heavier things with this. Or lift them like they're nothing and turn and place them anywhere. Tires aren't cool. Treads are much tougher. They can take you anywhere. And that's why I'm the strong. Hey, wait! Out of the way, make way for someone who's really strong. The strongest are always in a team. We're the crane truck. We're two friends who always work together. The crane can reach up to the sky with his hook and use it to lift heavy things and place them in the right spot. But not only can he lift things, he can also smash him. Bam! We've got six big wheels so we can move heavy objects fast and easily. But if the crane needs more support, I have extra legs to lift heavier and higher. Teamwork is definitely the best. I'll teach you, you giraffe. <laughs> You'll never catch us with those treads. <laughs> Kids, we all know the most fun thing isn't being strong or being with just one friend. It's being with lots of friends. My body is made especially for moving lots of people at once. And I have lots of comfortable seats and top-notch suspension, making me great for carrying all your friends. We'll drive through extreme conditions together and have crazy adventures. And when it's all said and done, I'll make sure you go home soon. I bring you and your friends together Oh no, look at the time! I'm late to pick up the kids from school again! Hi kids, I'm not the coolest or the strongest, and I can't take you and your friends on adventures. Some of you might have seen me before though. That's because I get up really early and drive through town. I use my mechanical arm to pick up garbage bins and clean unneeded objects and store them in my body. This means you can get rid of rubbish so your home doesn't get cluttered and is tidy and clean and has room for toys. <sighs> but I have to go to bed now. Tomorrow I'll be up early again. Bye kids, good night. Thanks for watching and tell us in the comments who your favorite vehicle is. Don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you next time. Search for At Mink TV. Hi everyone. Today's another beautiful day at At Mink Town. And guess what? We've got another lesson for you from Mr. Train. Are you excited? I know I am. Let's get started. Today, we're learning about fruit. Do you know what fruit is in this box? It's bananas. Bananas grow on palm trees and love to be eaten by monkeys. You just peel the yellow skin off and chow down. Now, what fruit is this? It's an apple. There are over 7,000 different types of apples. If you tried one per day, 
It'd take you 20 years to taste them all. Apples are delicious, but make sure you don't eat the middle. That bit's not very tasty. To get apples, we plant an apple seed from the core in the ground, and it grows into an apple tree. Now what's our next fruit? It's a pear. Pears come in different colors, including green, orange, yellow, and even red. And they grow on trees much like apples. The wood from pear trees can be used to make lots of nice things, like ornaments, tables, and musical instruments like the cello. Now our next fruit often comes in pears. It's cherries. Cherries grow on beautiful trees called cherry blossoms. They produce about 800 cherries. Cherries are great when you have them with dessert, like cupcakes or pies, and look great on top. Wow, look at the size of that cherry pie. I hope that's not just for you, Fennec Fox. Now this fruit will be hard to guess. Can you get it? It's a coconut. Coconuts grow on palm trees in tropical places like deserted islands. The trees can reach 20 meters tall, which is as high as an eighth floor building. Hi, Big Mink. Hi. Ah, oh, coconut. Now I bet you can all guess this fruit. It's the pineapple. Pineapples grow out of the ground and are actually a type of berry. If you slice off the top, you can use it to grow a new one. Wow, Mink, that pineapple is gigantic! Maybe you should invite your friends to help eat it. Wow, look at The largest pineapple is 32 centimeters long and weighed over 8 kilograms. Does everybody know this next fruit? It's lemons! Lemons grow on trees much like apples and pears. The trees are called evergreens and produce fruit all year. Oh, you like lemons, Miss Mink? No, too sour. Lemons are tastiest when you make lemonade by squeezing out their juices. You can also use lemons as a battery. Isn't that amazing? Okay, on to the next fruit. It's oranges. Oranges are another fruit that grows on trees like lemons. Oranges are like the children of Pinellos and the older <laughs> brothers of mandarins. <laughs> to eat an orange, first peel off the skin, which you can then use to make some nice tea or for making cakes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten. Oranges usually break into ten pieces after you take the skin off. Our next fruit is an old favorite. It's strawberries. Strawberries are covered in lots of tiny little seeds. The only fruit like this. There can be as many as 200. They grow on long stalks that come out of the ground that only produce fruit for five years. Strawberries are another fruit that goes great with dessert. The pineberry is a type of strawberry that's very pale and tastes like a pineapple. Do you know what our next fruit is? It's blackberries. They hang off the end of long branches. But watch out for the thorns. Blackberry leaves are great in tea. And if you feed blackberries to bees, they make delicious, dark, fruity honey. You can even use them to make pies, creams, ice creams, and jams, and they're all delicious. What do we have this time? It's the blueberry. Blueberries are great because you can eat lots of them before you get full. You can also use blueberries to make paint. So you and your friends can paint beautiful pictures. And just like other berries, you can make lots of delicious things like jams, pies, and ice creams. Thanks for another awesome lesson, Mr. Train. Let's go through them again. Banana, apple, pear, cherry, coconut, pineapple, lemon, orange, strawberry, blackberry, and blueberry. Thanks everyone for joining us on this learning adventure. Don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you next time.
everybody. We're back at At Mink Town today, and guess what? There's a surprise waiting for us at the police station. Let's go find out what it is. Oh, hello, Mr. Walkie Talkie. What have you got for us today? Oh, some wheels? What are these for? Oh, it's the blueprints for a police car. And the wheels are the first step. What's next, Mr. Walkie Talkie? It's whatever's in this box? Ah, it's the axles for the wheels. Let's get them connected up so that we have a foundation for our police car. like so much fun, Mr. Walkie Talkie. Uh-oh, it's Police Chief Mink. Oh wait, he's going to join in. Now that the wheels are getting into position, what's next? We've got the siren, the bumper, the hood and the headlights, and the trunk and the tail lights. Let's see where they need to go. Here comes the hood and the trunk. Oh, look out! Oh no, I hope they're okay. Here comes Mr. Walkie Talkie and Police Chief Mink with the wheels. Alright, nice job guys. Now the helicopter will lower the windshield and the roof. Here comes the bumper, jumping into place. Oh, and now here are the doors, flying in from the hills. You guys know what to do. That's right, right on the sides. Lastly, here comes the siren, jumping onto the roof. Good job, Mr. Walkie Talkie and Police Chief Mink. Now we can introduce the newest member of the At Mink Police Force, Mr. Police Car. Thanks, everybody. Now let's say goodbye to Mr. Police Car as he goes on his way. Please subscribe to At Mink's channel and see you next time! Hi everyone! Today we get to meet the new monster truck and take him in for an upgrade and some cool new body kit additions. Here he comes now! Alright, are you ready to go in? Right, let's go. Down the elevator to the mechanic room. Wow, this room is 
huge. Are you ready for your upgrade? First, let's take you through the car wash. Oh, you don't like the bathing idea, huh? Don't worry, it'll be okay. Nice and clean, that's it. Looking good. Now, to the designing room. Great! Now that we're in the designing room, let's try some colors. Let's see. Purple? Not bad. White? No, too bright. What about green? Oh, you don't like green? Hmm. How about blue? Yeah, this is perfect. All right, let's put on some cool decals and stickers for you. Wow, there's so many to choose from. Let's go with this one. Fire. That looks awesome. Now a sticker on the back, and some fire on the other side, and now some stickers under the lights at the front. This is looking so cool. What about the top? Perfect. Now let's change the color of the rims. Mm. Yellow. Those go perfectly with your new body color. Oh, what's in here? Wow! Look at all these props and accessories we can add. Punk hair? Afro hair? Horns? Even tusks? <laughs> these are hilarious! For now, let's just put a scoop on the hood and a wing at the back. And also add some exhaust pipes. Wow, you look awesome. This is amazing. You are the best monster truck I've ever seen. Let's show off these sweet new changes to our friends. Wow, amazing. So cool. Don't forget to subscribe to Acme so you don't miss any cool new upgrades like this guy just got. See you next time! Are you ready for the next song? This one's about an itsy bitsy little spider. Come on, let's sing! Itsy wincy spider climbed up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed poor Incy out. Out came the sunshine and dried up all the rain. So Incy wincy spider climbed up the spout again. Spider climbed up the water spout Down came the rain and washed poor Incy out Out came the sunshine and dried up all the rain So Incy Wincy Spider climbed up the spout again Spout. Down came the rain and washed poor Incy out Out came the sunshine and dried up all the rain So Incy Wincy Spider climbed up the spout again Incy Wincy Spider climbed up the water spout Down came the rain and washed poor Incy
Incy out. Out came the sunshine and dried up all the rain. So Incy Wincy Spider climbed up the spout again. Welcome back to At Mink Town. Looks like Mr. Train is doing well. <laughs> oh no, is that evil Dr. Pig? What's he doing? It looks very suspicious. What's in that bag? There are some very suspicious looking tools. And was that dynamite? What's he gonna do with that? Oh, this doesn't look good. Evil Dr. Pig, please, stop! Oh my gosh! This is terrible! Mink! No, no! Police copter, please help! The tunnel has been blown up! Somebody blew up the tunnel, please, Chief Mink! Oh, that's terrible! First we're gonna put out the fire, and then move that log! Good work, Mr. Fire Truck! Putting out the fire is a great first step! Same goes for you, Mr. Crane! Good work! Oh, what are we gonna do? Oh, how do we move all this? Oh, that evil Dr. Pig! Do. What's that, Miss Mink? You've got an idea. Aha! You think we should build a digger. Aw, oh, yeah, that's pretty clever. Look here! Alright, let's get started. We need the cap. Come on, cab. Don't leave us hanging. Next come the sides and the seat. Jump on, guys. And on to the base. Come on, Grill, what are you waiting for? Bucket. Quickly, we've got a tunnel to fix. Oh no. Evil Dr. Pig's minions are here to stop us. Next up, we need the tilt cylinder and the blade. Great work! And now, the tracks and the frame. Now we're 
ready to get rolling. Finally, the steering wheel gets to join. And now we're ready to help fix the tunnel. Oh, maybe a bit more power first. Oh, you're forgetting something. Huh? Thanks, Big Mink. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Thanks. See ya. All right, Mink. Let's go. Uh, uh. Uh, <laughs> Evil Dr. Pig's minions are trying to stop us again. Great work, Mink. No time to waste. Mm. Hurry, Mink. We gotta get this cleaned up. Don't worry. I'm on it. The train is coming. Hurry, Mink. <laughs> it's getting closer. I can do it. All right, this is you it. You can do it, Mink. <laughs> We did it, guys! Ah, I foiled again! The train is saved! Another crisis avoided thanks to Mink and his friends! <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe to at Mink so you can see what Mink and his friends are up to next time! See you then! All right, time to build a new friend. Do you know who it is? We're starting with the connector. Now we're adding the back and the wheels. Here comes the cab. Looking great. Our exhaust pipes, bumper, and roof. Then finally the back. Garbage truck. Garbage truck. That's right, it's Mr. Garbage Truck. Bicycle. Bicycle. Mr. Garbage Truck is taking the bicycle. What next? TV. TV. The TV is next. Now? A lamp next. Any more? Chair. Chair. He's taking a chair. What goes with a chair? Table. Table. Yep, a table. Great work, Mr. Garbage Truck. Ah! 
Hi everyone, and welcome to the big mink cart championship race. Are you ready? I know I am. Miss Mink has an idea. Whoa, yeah. what a cool move! Great work, Miss Mink. Oh no! The blocks got in the way! Now Fox Mink is making his move with the garbage cannon. Mink is still in the lead, though. Whoops. Oh, this looks fun. Wow, look at that strength! Oh, no. Uh-oh, what's evil Dr. Pig doing? Yeah, this will get him. He's using a pig cannon to destroy everyone's cars. Not fair. Careful, Mink. <laughs> Gonna win this now. Oh, no. What now? Driving on two wheels! This is amazing! Yeah, got another one. Come on, Mink! You can't let that cheater win! Shot, Mink. Yeah, uh, uh, they had it, get me. Uh, uh, me to help? Yeah, we're gonna help you. All right, it's a push race now. Lucky your friends are here to help. Uh, Come on, guys, you can do it! Yeah. And 
doing? Yay, you did it! Mink is the winner! Serves evil Dr. Pig right for cheating! Okay, what are we building today, Mink? Looks like we've got a chassis with different kinds of doors on each side. Interesting. Let's keep watching. Here comes the... Wheels. Th that's right! Wheels. Mr. Dump Truck is helping us with more parts. Now we have the full chassis. 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 What goes in the chassis? Engine. Engine. Yep, the engine. Now, what do we need to sit in? Seat. Yep, the seat. Seat. Let's start adding some of the outside parts. Now do you know who this guy is? Monster Truck. Monster Truck. Yep, he's a monster truck. Let him go! What a jump! Searching for target. Target located. Target locked on. Hello, police car. You must be here to become a monster truck. Are you ready? Great! Let's see what we'll need. Hmm. Looks like we need some new tires first. Let's start by removing the old ones. Don't worry, it'll be fixed soon. Yeah, this is a real monster truck wheel. What's next? Oh, the suspension. Wrap up nice and tight. Alright, we're going to need four of those. Time for the chassis. Stretch them out, that's it. Looking good. And now, the engine. Just jump right onto the chassis. That's it. 
Um, hello? Alright, that looks great! And finally, the cabin. Let's get going! Construction complete! Awesome! You're definitely the coolest police car ever! Amazing! Do you like it, Mr. Police Car? I thought you might. Let's go for a test drive. Whoa! Check out all those tricks! Wow! Amazing! That was awesome! We'll see you next time, everybody. And don't forget to subscribe to at Mink to make sure you don't miss the next episode. Good morning, everybody. It's still really early in at Mink Town, so we don't want to wake anyone up. Look at all the sleeping parts. Good morning, Mink. You're going to play us a song? Oh, wow. It sounds so cool. And it's woken up Mr. Crane Truck's parts. Let's watch him collect them all and put himself together. The wheels are getting ready and waiting for the body. Here he comes. The cab is getting the seat and some of the other parts on his way over. It's all coming together now. Looking great. Now, some of Mink's magical music is going to bring them together forever. Look at Mr. Crane carry those logs! Great work!
Is everyone ready for a song? Okay, let's go! Wheels on the bus go round and round, round and round, round and round. The wheels on the bus go round and round, all the way to town. The doors on the bus, they open and close, open and close, open and close. The doors on the bus, they open and close, all the way to town. The bus goes ching ching ching, ching ching ching, ching ching ching. The money on the bus goes ching ching ching, all the way to town. The driver on the bus says, Move on back, move on back, move on back. The driver of the bus says, Move on back, and don't forget to put your seatbelts on. All the way to town. The monkeys on the bus put the seat On the bus, go swish, swish, swish to wash away the rain. All the way through town. The antennas on the bus go back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Antennas on the bus go back and forth, and back and back and forth. The signals on the bus go blink, 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 blink. The signals on the bus go blink, blink. Wave out the window all the way to town. 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 To town. Hi, everybody, and welcome back to At Mink. Boy, have we got something exciting today! Look at all these fruits and colors! And guess what? That's what we're learning about today! Colors! Alright, so first up we have the tomato. Do you know what color it is? That's right! It's red! Great job! Oh, the hammer pressed the red button! And wow! Look at all the red tomatoes rolling in the pool! <laughs> oh look! And Mink too! Hi Mink! Hi! Okay, are you ready for the next one? What color is this fruit? Correct! Blue! That's why they're called blueberries! Time to hit the blue button and watch the blueberries roll into the pool. Look at them all. And it's funny Fox enjoying the pool with the blueberries this time. Next, we have lemons. Do you know what color lemons are? Absolutely right. They're yellow. Let's hit the yellow button and send the lemons into the pool now. And who have we got enjoying the pool this time? It's Big Mink. And he's got a lemon drink too. Okay, can you guess the color of our next fruit? Great guess! They're blackberries! Let's hit the black button and send the blackberry 
knees into the pool now. rolling around on a black ball, calling the pool to himself. How mean! <laughs> now we've got a coconut. What color is a coconut, everybody? You got it! It's brown! Let's hit the brown button and check out the coconuts. Very cool, Big Mink. Our next fruit is the watermelon. Do you know what color a watermelon is? Right again. It's green. Now to hit the green button. Look at all the watermelons. these raspberries? That's it! Purple! They're purple raspberries! Let's hit the purple button and get some raspberries in the pool. Oh no! It's evil Dr. Pig again and he's looking suspicious. This time, we have a vegetable. It's garlic. What color is garlic? You got it again. It's white. Now to hit the white button and get some garlic in our pool. Tell us in the comments, or tell us what you'd like to learn next time. Alright, now we're over at the At Ming Town Railway Station. And guess what? We're going to build Mr. Train. Let's start assembling him. Now, what have we got here? Rocket. That's right! And 
where does a rocket go to? Space. Great work! Look at that! The rocket was actually part of the train! Starting to look good, Mr. Train! Now the dump truck is here! What have you got for us? Wheels! Wow! Thanks so much! They'll be a great help! And what's next? Engine. That's right! The engine helps the wheels work. All right, just the finishing touch is left. Now, what have we got here? Train. That's right, it's Mr. Train. And what's this he's going to pull? Wagon. Yep, a wagon. Let's watch him go. Wow, looking great, Mr. Train. Hi everyone, and welcome back to AppMink. Today, Mr. Train is going to help us learn about numbers. Look at all those numbers we're going to get to learn today. First up, we have number one, and we have one monster car next to it. The crane and trucks are helping us with some logs. Hi. Oh, and you've got number two. Just like how you have two arms and two legs. The school bus and the monster truck are helping us out with this one. Now number three. And look, three stars. The dump truck is going to help us create the three using nuts. Next comes the number four, and it's surrounded by four umbrellas. Mr. Train is going to show us how to make a four. Great work! Oh no, number five is surrounded by five of Evil Dr. Pig's minions. But don't worry, Mr. Helicopter is here to show us how to make one. Number six. Look at all the presents. This time, Mr. Police Car will help us. Now, number seven. That's how many colors there are in a rainbow. The monster truck is making a seven with Lego bricks. And guess what? For number eight, we have eight Lego bricks as well. Lots of cars are showing us how to make an eight. 
Now we get to number nine. And there's nine apples. Let's make a nine on the wall with a paint roller. Finally, number 10, with 10 balloons. Mr. Train is making the zero, and the logs are making the one. Now, let's go through them all one more time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Thanks for showing us how to count to 10, Mr. Train. We had lots of fun. Don't forget to subscribe to App Mink so we can learn more cool things. See you next time. Hi, everybody, and welcome back to another educational adventure with Mr. Train and everyone from App Mink Town. Hi, Mr. Train. Today, we're going to learn about shapes. How many shapes do you know? Let's find out. The first shape is a circle. Did you know that the sun is a circle? Look at how happy he is about it. The police car and the school bus are showing us how the circle goes round and round. Next is the triangle. Did you know pyramids are made from triangles? These pyramids come all the way from Egypt. Mr. Train is showing us the triangle shape this time. Our third shape is the square. A square has four sides. Look at those exciting square presents. I wonder what's inside. The monster truck is bringing us four Lego blocks to make the four sides of the square. Our next shape is the pentagon. Did you know that the black spots on soccer balls are pentagons? But not the white spots. We'll find out about those next. The crane trucks are bringing us logs to use as the five sides of the pentagon. Stop! Oh, wait, it's just our next shape, the hexagon. Now, if we line up the holes at the end of these six beams, we can make a hexagon. Let's lock them in place with the screws. Our sixth shape is a super shape. It's the star. And we have our superstar star here with us too. What's this? What is Evil Dr. Pig doing? Oh, he's pretending to be Pac-Man and eating Pac-Dots in the corners of the star. Now, we've got a diamond shape. Most kites are diamond shaped, with the tail flowing down from the bottom point. To make a diamond, we're going to get some help from our good friend, Mr. Duck Truck. Next is one of the loveliest shapes, the heart shape. Look at all the heart that little bear has got to give. Remember to give the people you love hearts like this bear to show them you care. Mr. Helicopter is going to draw a big heart in the sky for us. Thanks so much, Mr. Helicopter. It looks great. Our ninth shape is the oval. And what are the ovals we have in the basket? That's right, they're eggs. The dump truck is going to dump the eggs in the shape of an oval. It's an oval of ovals. Great work, Mr. Dump Truck! Our last shape is the rectangle. It looks like a stretched out square. Let's build a rectangle out of blocks. And now that we know how to make one, we can paint a rectangle on the wall. If you think you can draw a rectangle as well, draw one in the air with your finger. That's all of the shapes for today. Let's go through them one more time. Circle, triangle, square, pentagon, hexagon, star, diamond, heart, oval, and rectangle. Thanks so much for your help, Mr. Train, and everyone else from App Mink. 
don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you next time! Searching for target. Target located. Target locked on. Hello, police car. You must be here to become a monster truck. Are you ready? Great! Let's see what we'll need. Hmm. Looks like we need some new tires first. Let's start by removing the old ones. Don't worry, it'll be fixed soon. Yeah, this is a real monster truck wheel. What's next? Oh, the suspension. Wrap up nice and tight. All right, we're going to need four of those. Time for the chassis. Stretch them out, that's it. Looking good. And now, the engine. Just jump right onto the chassis. That's it. Um, hello? Alright, that looks great. And finally, the cabin. Let's get going. Construction complete. Awesome. You're definitely the coolest police car ever. Amazing. Do you like it, Mr. Police Car? I thought you might. Let's go for a test drive. Whoa. Check out all those tricks. Wow, amazing. That was awesome. We'll see you next time, everybody. And don't forget to subscribe to App Mink to make sure you don't miss the next episode. Search for App Mink. Here's Mr. Train again. What's he got for us today? Train. It's blueprints for a fire truck and all the parts we need to build it. Look at that. Big Mink has the wheels for us. Wheels. And Mink's got some too. Oh, Miss Mink needs some help. Thanks for helping, Mink. That was too heavy, even for Big Mink.
What's next? Oh, using helicopter hats. Great idea. All right, now the cab. Look at how strong Big Mink is. Now the cab is on, and the lights too. Let's add some of the panels. And what's next? Door. That's right. Some more parts for the back. Who's that helping us with the back part? Crane trunk. Yep, great work. Now, what's this last piece? Ladder. Yep, the ladder. Looking great, everyone. What lovely photos! Oh, Mink has a present for our fire truck. It's a magic orb that brings him to life. Now one more time, who have we got here? Fire truck. That's right, it's Mr. Fire Truck. Okay, kids, it's time for a song. Do you know about Old MacDonald and his farm? You do? Then sing along. Old 
Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on that farm he had some ducks, E-I-E-I-O, with a quack quack here and a quack quack there, here a quack, there a quack, everywhere a quack quack. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. E-I-E-I-O And on that farm he had some pigs E-I-E-I-O With an oink oink here and an oink oink there Here an oink, there an oink, everywhere an oink oink Old MacDonald had a farm E-I-E-I-O Well, Old MacDonald had a farm E-I-E-I-O And on that farm he had some cows E-I-E-I-O with a moo moo here and a moo moo there Here a moo, there a moo, everywhere a moo moo Old MacDonald had a farm E-I-E-I-O Yeah, Old MacDonald had a farm E-I-E-I-O And on that farm he had some dogs E-I-E-I-O with a woof woof here and a woof woof there Here a woof, there a woof, everywhere a woof woof Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O Yeah, Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O And on that farm he had some cats, E-I-E-I-O with a meow meow here and a meow meow there Here a meow there meow everywhere a meow meow Old MacDonald had a farm E-I-E-I-O Well, Old MacDonald had a farm E-I-E-I-O And on that farm he had some horses E-I-E-I-O With a nay nay here and a nay nay there Here a nay there nay everywhere a nay nay Old MacDonald had All right, kids, we're going to learn about numbers. And guess what? We're going to learn with some awesome car jumping stunts. Now that we've made the ramps, we need our first car. And here's the monster truck, ready to do his first jump. How many cars are there? One. One. Next. Two. Whoa, a 360. Two. All right, ready for the next jump? Three. Wow, a backflip. Three. Four. Reverse into 180. Four. Wow. Okay, getting hotter. Five. Five. Six. Another 360. Six. More cars. Seven. Another reverse into 180. Seven. Eight. Whoa, a barrel roll. Eight. Okay, here we go. Nine. Another backflip. Nine. Ten. Last jump. Ten. He made it. Great work, Mr. Monster Truck. Thanks for helping us learn to count. This time. Not so fast, <laughs> Evil Dr. <Doctor> Pig. <laughs> evil Dr. Pig thinks he can steal Miss Mink's bag and get away with it? I don't think so. He's driving like a maniac, helicopter. We need to stop him fast before he causes too much damage. Go, car! You can do it! 
How can I shake off that pesky police car? <laughs> I know. Oh no! Car, watch out! Phew, close call. But now I've lost it. Car, there's another way. Go back to the previous intersection and make a right. Look straight ahead, and I think you'll find Evil Dr. Pig on the bus card in the distance. Huh? Police car again! Where did he come from? Time to end this. I know what will get the police car off my tail. Time to use the oil slick. <laughs> nice dodge, car. Thanks, helicopter. Time to speed it up. <laughs> Battering ram systems, go! Hey, what the? Be careful with that thing. Good idea, car. Now's your chance. Oh no, it didn't work. So close, I need a way to get out. Wait, what's that? A tunnel! Finally, I'll be able to get rid of car! Oh no, not again! Now, how will we catch evil Dr. Pig? Finally! A free pig! <laughs> huh? Time to drop a spike strip! A spike strip! Ah! <laughs> you may be able to stop my car, but I can still get away on foot! Not so fast, evil Dr. Pig! Oh no, you don't, evil Dr. Pig. Hmm. Huh? Oh no! Huh? Huh? Oh. Oh, back in prison again! <laughs> I sure am glad no one was hurt today. And we could return Miss Mink's bag. Yeah, I'm glad too, Helicopter. Us cars, we make the best police vehicles. Just look at my shiny motor. It is so powerful. At top speed, I can reach up to 130 miles per hour. Bad guys like Evil Dr. Pig see me coming in their rear vision mirror before they can even say yikes. With my motor, I can rise high up into the sky. Whoa, steady there, helicopter. You'll go right through the top of this building if you're not careful. And the last thing I want to be doing is cleaning up a big mess. For us cars, control is important. We need the best steering to avoid objects on the road. People, animals, and sometimes big rocks, and even oil. Good steering helps us to move around these objects with ease. Helicopters too have plenty of air and space to fly around in, but we also need to change direction quickly. That's why we use our tail rotor. Tail rotors also help keep us stable. Without it, we'd spin around and around in circles. Oh, that sounds scary. We have tires to help us stay stable on the road. Can you think of any conditions that would make it difficult for us to stay on the road, helicopter? In the snow? And the rain? Exactly! But good tires keep us on the road, especially at high speed. They are also useful when driving through slippery mud. I bet you would need a good bath after that! Sure do! And I really don't like baths. We also have a rear wing that helps us stay on the road. Not to mention, rear wings look seriously cool. Don't you think, helicopter? It sure does look cool, car. But as you know, helicopters don't want to stay on the ground. They want to fly high into the sky so they can see everything below. We have these huge main rotors to help us do that. I was wondering when you would mention those. <laughs> Sorry, car. Now I will definitely be sure to let you know when I'm around. I could do that with my siren and flashing lights. The lights flash red and blue, and the siren makes a sound like this. Wow, so loud! But wouldn't you rather sneak up quietly on bad guys? Good point, helicopter. But sirens and flashing lights let other people know that I am coming. That way they can move out of harm's way. We need special lights too. 
we have a large spotlight for spotting things at night. With our spotlight, we can easily find bad guys. Also, it warns people of potential danger. Wow, helicopter! That is a very bright spotlight. And I can feel the warmth of it. It's like I'm sitting around a campfire. Do you have any marshmallows that we could cook and eat? <laughs> no, I don't have any marshmallows. Sorry, car. I can also make loud sounds through my loudspeaker. With my spotlight and loudspeaker, maybe we can host a special admin disco party. Sounds like fun. You know what, helicopter? We sure do have a lot of differences. But when we work together, we make a great crime-fighting team. Teamwork sure is important, car. Miss Mink was so happy when she got her bag back today. With teamwork, we can make such a difference and help people. We sure can. Everybody. Hello! Today, we are going to build a helicopter. Are you ready? Yeah. Yes! First, we should call the landing skis. Wow, here they are! is coming. Right on its place. Everything we need to be stable. Hey monster truck! Are these the parts for the helicopter's tail? rotor. Cool. Over here. Helicopter. Time the doors. One, two, three, four. Well done. <laughs> ah, the keys. You can do it, Mink! Yeah! Here we go! Cool! A 
Okay, kids, let's learn some letters. A. Apple. B. Car. D. Door. E. Eggs. Flower. G. Gift. H. Hat. Ice cream. That was great. Let's check them out one more time. Now, let's take a break. Ready for more? Okay. J. Jelly. K. Kite. Magnet. N. Nut. O. Orange. Piano Q Queen Rose.
Cruz. Great work, everyone. Let's take these letters for a ride. Okay, ready for the last part, everyone? Let's go! S Star T Turtle U Unicorn V Violin Xylophone Why? Yellow Zip <laughs> That's it, everyone! That's the whole alphabet! Amazing work! Now, let's take these letters for a drive too! 